Hello everybody, my name is Cap and welcome back to CapTech. One of the most important things you can do on your computer to protect it from malicious software or viruses, spyware, pop-ups, and any other kind of malicious programs that can be run in the background is keeping your system up to date. Most people do a pretty good job about keeping their operating system up to date by running their Windows updates and I'm glad that people do that. I highly recommend doing that. But something a lot of people do not do is update all the software that they installed. For instance, their Office or their Reader programs or anything like that. So today I want to introduce you to an easy way to help keep all your software up to date. Now real quick, this is not a paid promotion. Ninite has not contacted me asking me to do this. This is a program I use in my personal and my professional life and have used it for years. And I just want to let as many people know about this because it really does make life a lot easier. One of the biggest problems with keeping your software up to date is that it takes a long time to do that. Programs like Adobe do a fairly decent job of pushing out updates if you leave everything installed and it will notify you down here in your system trays that you have a new version of Adobe Reader or Adobe Flash. Things like that will come up and ask you. But for all of your other things, a lot of times you may not even know that you have an update for it. Now it's vitally important that you keep your software up to date because with all the malicious software and problems going on in the computing world, anytime that there's an exploit or a problem found, software publishers will push out an update fixing those problems. Even if you never download the most updated version, then you're left exposed. So now the way that Ninite works is you go to the website, Ninite.com, and the link will be down in the video description below, and you'll go through and you'll select all the different apps that you possibly want. You can go through and select every single one of these that you absolutely use, or you can kind of pick and choose, and I'll show you what I mean here. Now what I like to do is I like to have multiple installers and the reason why is if you happen to go through here and you select every single program you want to update, every time you run this it's going to go through and check for updates on every single one of those. Now that is great if you want to just double click it and run it and let it go, but if you want to be able to update things on a quicker fashion, what you can do is similar to what I would do here. Say for instance, like I want to make sure just my Java is up to date. So I would go through and select just the Java update and click on get your night night. Takes only just a second, takes you to the next page, and then it'll ask you where you want to save it, giving it a specific name based on the apps you chose. And then I'll just choose a folder and see I already have a Java updater so I'm not going to overwrite this but I would just name it Java updater. And then I would go through, come back in here and make one just for my browsers. And then I would get another installer. And then I might come through here and I would get one just for my security software. And the reason why is every time you run this, what it's going to do is it's going to go through the prepare setup and it's going to check to make sure everything you have checked in that app list is up to date. Now one of the nicest things about Ninite is, is it will check for 32-bit and 64-bit versions of the software that you have installed. And as you can see here, if I happen to have the most updated version already, it just automatically skips it. Another thing that's great about having Ninite the way it works here is that when it goes through and checks and does the downloads and installs, you can see it goes through and it'll download one at a time here and start installing it, and then it moves on and starts downloading and installing the next one here. But one of the nicest things that it does too is it skips all of those prompts that you would normally get when you're asked to install software like, uh, where do you want to install it? Do you agree to the terms of service on this? Do you want to install the Bing toolbar, the MSN toolbar, or so many other programs that all have the little check boxes there? It, eliminates all those that completely skips them and it skips the request to restart your computer that a lot of these software updates will require every single time you do this. So as I mentioned, Ninite is an excellent software to be able to install a bulk number of software applications at the same time. Now you can use it for doing updates like I do, or you can use it to do the very first installation. If you just know you're working on a new computer, or you're going to be re-imaging your computer and you want to be able to install everything over again, you can go through here and check every single program that you might want to use, and then download the installer, run it, and it'll keep everything up to date. 
Now, you do have the option, if you happen to have a business or a large network here, for the pro version of it. Now, the pro version isn't free. It's $20 a month for 100 machines, but it will allow you to download and install and push out major updates like this for an entire network. Now, I myself have never used this because I don't have a large enough network to use it, but I have read good things about how well it works and integrating with Windows servers and things of that nature. But this is a software I absolutely recommend. There is no installation, it's free, there's no pop-ups, there's no ads that come along with it. It's just a really good tool to have and it makes it so much easier to do this. So I highly recommend that you go to 99.com, select all the software that you might want to make even multiple updaters similar to the way I do have here and then use it to keep your software update and it will help keep your computer protected. Thank you guys so much for all your time. I hope this taught you something useful. And if you have any questions, be sure to drop them in the comments below. You guys have a good one, and I will talk to you later.